Welcome to Twisted Tales with me, Kimmy K. In this spine-chilling series, we'll be taking a deep dive into the darkest corners of reality and fiction. From notorious figures to unsettling events, this series will have you questioning what's lurking in the shadows. So get comfortable, grab a blanket and turn off the lights. Join me as we dive into these eerie bedtime stories that you'll probably never forget. The first story is a P. Diddy party. party. Once upon a time, under light so bright, lived a mogul named Diddy, a king of the night. He threw lavish parties with stars shining through. But what went on inside? Well, no one really knew. The world saw the glamour, the glitz and the glow. But behind the curtains, a sinister show. For Diddy's gatherings were far from clean. They were more horror than Hollywood dream. The night would start with champagne on ice. Everyone dressed up and looking nice. But behind every closed door, a different game played where the innocent were lured and then betrayed. Young women and children, so eager for fame, came in with a dream, but left with only shame. Their drinks were spiked, their trust was betrayed. But hey, it's Hollywood. Everyone gets played. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Diddy would say with his twisted grin. Fame is yours. Just do what you're told. Don't worry. Just a little of your soul is sold. In dark, sweaty rooms, men leered with glee, while victims danced in pain, trying to flee. But the music kept thumping, the bass kept strong. After all, what's a little torment if the night's still young? The boys wide-eyed were fed promises bold. Follow me, kid, and you'll be made of gold. But what they found was darker than sin. The price of fame was being pulled right in. Children promised millions, but paid in fear, forced to stay quiet, keep that little mouth clear. Do what I say and you'll be a star. But if you speak up, you won't get far. They were led into rooms with curtains drawn tight, where Hollywood's horrors come out in the night. Contracts were signed in blood or sweat. Either way, by morning, their futures were set. Diddy made sure they danced and obeyed, while A-list guests continued to watch and play. No worries, Diddy would say with a smirk. Just a little pain is part of the work. In one of those rooms, lit dimly by red, Cries for help echoed, but nobody fled. For silence was key, and fear was the price. And you don't leave a diddy party without rolling the dice. The air was thick with the scent of despair, as victims were passed with barely a care. Men watched in shadows with glaring eyes, as diddy orchestrated the night's cruel ties. I'll make you famous, he'd coo in their ear. As the victims realised they'd disappear, the women would sob, <laughs> the boys would shake. But promises of fortune, they were all fake. <laughs> Baby oil lined shelves, bottles galore, next to tranquilizers stashed in a drawer. The tunnels were dark, deep and cold. Where children were traded, their futures were sold. And what of the stars? The celebs who were there, while well, they weren't exactly unaware. They saw the victims, the terror, the dread, but they kept their mouths shut, scared of being dead. For Diddy had power, his reach was wide, and those who defined him didn't survive. Rival artists had spoken before. Now they were dead, sprawled on the floor. A tragic plane crash, or an overdose, they'd say. But everyone knew it wasn't that way. So the celebs just smiled, sipping their wine, pretending that everything was perfectly fine. Oh, that's just Hollywood, some would laugh, where accidents happen, like magic on staff. Sure, my friend's gone, but we're all okay. 
Just don't say a word and you'll live another day. But even the darkest parties can't last forever. One night the cops came sharp, clean and clever. The doors were kicked in, the tunnels explored and what they found, well, nobody was bored. Thousands of bottles, drugs on the shelves, a labyrinth of tunnels, dark as hell's dells. The victims were rescued, their stories they tell of nights spent in Diddy's twisted version of hell. Celebs who had once laughed were now shaking as the empire crumbled, the mansion quaking. Diddy was cuffed, his reign tore apart, but the damage was done, he'd left his mark. Now Diddy waits in a cell of stone, his power shattered, his secrets known. But there's a whisper on the Hollywood breezes that a man like Diddy can do what he pleases. Money talks and deals are made and some say Diddy's planning his escape parade. Will he rot in a cell? Maybe not for long. For men like him, the system's not that strong. Each day brings new horrors to light, more victims speaking of their fateful night. Hundreds of testimonies all in a row Hollywood's dark side continues to grow. Is this the end or is this the start? For behind the fame, there's still a black heart. And Hollywood's glamour, just a thin veil, covering secrets far darker than any tale. So beware the glitter, the light's so bright. For behind the fame, there's plenty of fright. It's all just a game, a cruel masquerade, where the innocent are played and souls are weighed. And though Diddy's locked up, for now he's caught. Remember this, fame can't be bought, at least not without paying the toll. For fame and fortune, you have to sell your soul. So close your eyes, drift into sleep. But remember, fame's price is always steep. For behind every party, every cheer, there's always a darkness lurking near. Thank you so much for watching this dark bedtime story. If you like this one, I will be posting another one next week. So don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss it. YouTube thinks you'll also like this video next. Good night.